What's up everybody, welcome to Money Management Channel. My name is Andre and today I'm gonna be doing an update on MMTLP and Finra Sark. And for today's video guys, I have an amazing news. Uh, probably you already know that just uh, several hours ago, uh, Next Bridge Hydrocarbons published a press release that is a pure bombshell. And uh, this uh, press release will definitely change a lot in our current situation. And before we dive deep into all of this, guys, please just hit the like button. It is very important uh, for me and for my channel to see this uh, support from you, from my viewers. So, and uh, I don't want to dig deep inside uh, this uh, press release because... Uh, for example, Ali uh, from Trading Secrets and uh, even uh, Bird Lady already made these type of videos. But I want to uh, show you just crucial points. First of all, this is the very promising results uh, of the drilling program. Let me quote to this. The Johnson E23 number 4 well is a new field discovery in the Pan Sand formation and we believe it is the first viable conventional producer in the Texas portion of the Orgrande Basin. Additionally, the Johnson E15 number no. 1, which is approximately 5,000 feet uh, away from uh, the number no. 4 discovery well, showed comparable gas flares while drilling the pan sand. The company also continues to work uh, on other potential pay horizons uh, that had good uh, to excellent petrophysical log analysis from our third party uh, petrologists. And uh, guys, these three paragraphs alone drastically improve uh, the intrinsic value of next bridge hydrocarbon shares. And uh, within just several minutes, I will show you that potentially the price, uh, uh, the intrinsic value, the price based on the intrinsic value alone of uh, next bridge hydrocarbon shares already reached uh, about $500 per share. And guys, it is uh, just a baseline uh, uh, according to the recent updates. On top of that, uh, let me show you further on uh, the MLTLP Resources website. You can see uh, the article Blockbuster News from Next Bridge Must Read. And uh, this uh, article is completely dedicated to the same press release. And let me show you some uh, more information. The rest of the PR speaks of some reorganizing among senior staff and news directly to struggling shareholders. Uh, so, Greg McCabe became a CEO and uh, another person uh, from uh, Torchlight Energy became a chief financial officer. On top of that, the board of uh, directors uh, for now has one more additional member. Next Bridge is also pleased to announce the addition of Edward Pocock uh, to its board of directors. Mr. Pocock is a longtime shareholder, USAF veteran and public servant with expertise in governmental relations. He is a retired 25-year veteran of law enforcement in state of uh, Connecticut, commanding both uh, patrol and detective divisions uh, of his uh, department before retirement. During Mr. Pacock's uh, tenure in law enforcement, he gained extensive investigative experience in a multitude of disciplines, including the investigation of uh, embezzlement, uh, fraud, theft and the misapplication of funds. So, guys, it is not a coincidence that this person with this uh, huge experience in investigation was hired as a member of board of directors. And definitely it uh, leads to the conclusion that potentially we are about to see even more facts uh, that uh, the MMTLP saga was made uh, illegally. And guys, on top of that, uh, let me quote you further. Greg McCabe wrote this. As we enter a new year for the next breach, Mr. McCabe and uh, the company continue to share the deep concerns of our shareholders regarding the circumstances surrounding U3 halt of trading prior to the next breach spin out and the unknown volume of uncovered short position that may persist in our company. And guys, this is the first time uh, for next breach hydrocarbons when uh, they stated about the illegal U3 halt and uh, the unknown share count. We have uh, quite a significant breakthrough in our case and uh, with uh, Greg McCabe as the head of this company, we potentially might see the resolution of this problem in a near-term perspective. On top of that, let me quote to this. We have offered to speak with FIRA and the SEC 
to discuss our data and we also hope to receive clarity on the basis of their own conflicting data. Another, another amazing statement. On top of that, guys, in addition to the above bombshells, the press release talks about Next Bridge hiring Johnny Tabaka and his firm to help reconcile the settlement issue with MMTLP. And uh, Johnny Tabaka just recently made a huge due diligence. Uh, he found out a lot of uh, facts who was uh, the wrongdoer inside uh, the authorities and who did what in this uh, saga. On top of that, his company, uh, uh, the token team LLC, led the first ever successful public digital dividend uh, on the blockchain, executed by Overstock uh, subsidiary T0. And token team will help NextBridge fully understand all facets and uh, consequences of uh, a potential listing on a blockchain trading platform. And this is another another bombshell that uh, potentially will lead to the 100% uh, transparent trades uh, for MMTLP and next bridge uh, hydrocarbon shares. And guys, all of uh, these uh, updates are really crucial. And let me show you how these uh, updates uh, might improve the intrinsic value of the company. First of all, and uh, I basically did it uh, several times, uh, at least two times uh, to this moment. And this is the third time where I pay my attention to the video that was made by Tony from Market Moves with Tony. Unfortunately, he passed away uh, this uh, summer, but uh, his due diligence is really important uh, for the community. And let me show you what uh, was uh, done by him back uh, in uh, summer of this year, in uh, June 19th of 2023. You can find this uh, video on MTLP NBH, let's talk about oil, where he explained uh, the potential price of next bridge uh, depending on the uh, oil prices. And uh, we have uh, basically two possibilities. First of all, if uh, the uh, oil and gas assets uh, will remain in the ground. This means uh, with the price of oil in between 80 and 120 dollars. And guys, this is my estimation of the oil price for the upcoming several uh, months to years. Because uh, from the technical standpoint, we shouldn't break uh, 60 or uh, 70 dollars mark and we shouldn't break 120 somewhere here this is the corridor where the oil price should be for the upcoming i guess couple of years and based on this information uh, the share price uh, of uh, next bridge hydrocarbons should be in between 46.88 uh, dollars and 88.54 uh, dollars but we have an additional fact that drastically improved uh, the uh, intrinsic value of next bridge hydrocarbons and this is the latest PR, definitely. The latest PR could easily improve these numbers uh, by 50% at least. And uh, the second possibility, the most important one, when the oil and gas assets uh, will be taken to the production, the share price uh, will be much higher. Let me show you that uh, uh, based on these calculations, so with the dividend yield of 6%, uh, and it is quite similar to the average dividend yields uh, for other oil and gas companies, the oil, the share price uh, should be uh, in between $208.33 all the way up to $442.71. And guys, if the dividend yields uh, is uh, lower than this uh, 6%, uh, this means the value of uh, these uh, shares will be drastically higher. Let's uh, put it this way, if uh, the dividend yields uh, is 3%, we can easily double these uh, numbers. On top of that, guys, the most recent updates uh, from the PR drastically improves uh, these numbers as well for at least 50%. And this means uh, we can easily double these numbers. On top of that, guys, a lot of people uh, might argue that uh, the oil and gas assets are not yet confirmed. But guys, uh, you know that Greg McCabe just became a CEO of this company and he is the largest shareholder. And guys, let me show you his uh, biography. He is an experienced geologist who brings over 32 years of oil and gas experience uh, to our company. He is a principal of numerous oil and gas focuses, uh, focused entities, uh, including McCabe Petroleum Corporation, Mannix Royalty, a Masterson Royalty Fund and G Mac Exploration. 
He has been the president of McCabe Petroleum Corporation from 1986 to the president. Mr. McCabe has been involved in numerous oil and gas ventures throughout uh, his career and uh, has a vast experience in technical evaluation, operations and acquisitions. Mr. McCabe is also our largest stockholder and provided entity for us uh, into two into our two largest assets, uh, the Hazel project uh, in the Midland Basin and the Orogrande project in Hotspeth County, Texas. And guys, don't you think that this uh, person with this uh, huge, huge experience in oil and gas uh, industry and uh, the person who has the largest uh, number of shares of Next Bridge Hydrocarbons, do you believe that uh, with all these details uh, there is uh, no oil? in our ground the project it doesn't make sense this means i think uh, the real intrinsic value of uh, next bridge hydrocarbon shares uh, might be drastically higher than these numbers and it is just uh, my estimation but any other steps towards the resolution will improve these numbers even more as you can see these calculations uh, was made with the number of shares of uh, slightly below 240 million shares. It is uh, the current share price, official share price, without the uh, huge number of counterfeit shares. We don't know this number, that is why we cannot rely on uh, any other numbers than this. But if uh, all the counterfeit shares will be added to the equation, the, these wrongdoers will be forced to buy back uh, the shares. And the only way how they can do it uh, is uh, from uh, the next bridge hydrocarbons itself. And when Next Bridge Hydrocarbon sells these shares, uh, all of these funds will be divided uh, through the existing shareholders uh, with the dividend, additional dividends. Or they can be spent uh, to explore even more oil and gas uh, resources in the Orogrande Basin. And both of these actions will drastically improve the share price as well. So guys, I think it is an amazing news and uh, I think uh, this uh, is the uh, part of the resolution, the huge resolution that we are about to see. So, I think that's all information that I want to provide you. If you like my video, please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel with notification bell. And see you guys and girls next time. Bye! I got the cash in the bag, stadium pack. Born a rock star in this life, gonna live it up on the attack. Baby, I'm bad. I just wanna get caught up in this life. I'm crazy, I'm bad. Doing no cap. Only God.